apologize for the ways. Hi. Hi. Are you okay? I'm fine. It's just, again, it's just, it's just not great, is it? I was, I was worried about you. I, I didn't want you to get upset for whatever reason. I didn't realise that was going to happen. No, I'm not going to lie. It's, it's upsetting because it just brings negativity to my life. And right. it causes a rolling, trolling impact. Um, mm. You know, I'm not going to lose sleep over it, but, you know, it's just an attack for that I was unaware of. It came out of nowhere. And it's just completely unnecessary. Like, if he's triggered by somebody saying that, he needs to put out PR as to why he's professional, but instead he decides not to and goes, oh, look at my 500 grand watch. Like honestly, I mm. I honestly don't care. Like you're nothing. It's not even relevant to me. Oh, I would never treat you like that. So yeah, it's just it's just upsetting. It just brings negativity to my life. So apart from that, you're doing all right. Yeah. Oh, that's good. Well, you look you look really good today, if I may add. Thank you. The hell no. But um, in future, I'll just I'll make sure that you know he doesn't like attack you again. Trust. Also, the question that I was asked was a flippant mm. question on a silly podcast. It's snog, marry, avoid. It's like it's mm. not even. It's not like I'm doing videos about it because no. honestly, whatever he's doing, I honestly don't care. Like either way, it's just it's just it pisses me off big time. That then the effects of trolling is constant. Well, you've always got my support, so thank you. So, I mean, I'm never gonna go against you like you showed me kindness i'm always going to show you kindness now that's the type of person i am yeah thank you that's the same for me i i i i, I appreciate that you said i was a really nice kind guy that i appreciated when you said that i was like yeah, oh that's sweet you, yeah but you actually are though you have a mm. sense of decorum and being demure and it, it's just your your commercial people this is my opinion people like ed people like hs they walk this very fine line between mm. being deplatformed and like bullying that's why half of their accounts have been lost and they've been moved to places like telegram like right. you have to have a sense of decorum and being kind and professional to people when you are on this app if you want to be a creator and yeah. that that's what I strive to do. You know, I'm not here to bring negativity to anybody's life and berate them live unexpectedly. It's just like, I, I, life is too short for that, quite frankly. And I think if he's so happy and he's so sure of himself, why is he being triggered by a tiny two second clip of me jokingly calling him a scammer? Like, it's literally, it's not even that deep. It's bizarre. Yeah, definitely. I, I agree with that. Um, I didn't catch how old you were. Oh, I'm 30. Oh, okay. Do you, can you guess how old I am? I think you're probably, like, 27. Thanks so much. I'm 40. What? Hmm. No, are you actually? Well, actually. <laughs> no, you're not. What the fuck? <laughs> no, you're fucking not. <laughs> no, you're not. What the fuck? No, you're not. Wait, George, what year were you born? 1983. <laughs> That's so strange. <laughs> 
hell? It's because I I never smoke or drank, and I look after my skin somewhat. So my skin is really like de-aged, like a de-aged filter on it. But hopefully you, <laughs> hopefully you go for older guys. Otherwise, I'm fucked, aren't I? Do you know what I mean? A de-aged filter. That sounds good. Yeah, trust. But I think that's a massive compliment. Someone. I mean, that's not too bad. Ten, ten year age gap. That's not too bad. That's you not too bad. Wrote 1983 game. <laughs> yeah, trust. Isn't it? I do my best. I do my best. I'm like a gentleman at heart. I, I'm not. I may come across as like drop and lose game, but in person, I'm actually passionate. I'm a gentleman like that. Yeah, no, you're a super gentleman. Genuinely, you yeah. are. Like you're you rate that then? Yeah, hundred percent. This is what yeah, I, yeah. Trying, I think. This is what I was trying to say to you and um, bloody. Uh, what's his face yesterday? Carl. Carl yeah, so Carl's quite yeah. similar because Carl, Carl is actually just genuinely such a nice, kind guy. He never says anything particularly out of line. He has a bit of a joke and a flirt. And you're just like, yeah, do you know what? He's just a nice guy. And I think with other people that are on this app, you can just tell there's like a slight toxic vibe of certain people. And you're just like... Yeah. It's just not healthy. <laughs> exactly. I think, obviously, I'm getting lots of love from the community. And obviously, HS and Ed want some of that love as well. Yeah. And they know if they're going to be seen on live with me and doing clips with me, they're going to get better love. And they actually do. They, yeah. they really do. So, And obviously, if I am going to Dubai, that will be nice to spend time with HS in person. But if it doesn't happen, it's not gonna like affect me that much either like do that i mean because i i don't sorry do you know when you're going no idea i haven't even i literally need to dm him and tell him if you're gonna buy me plane tickets this is the airport you need to buy plane tickets yeah. from and to dubai and get me a return ticket as well please because obviously well, he's so, he's I... rich. it should be business class really shouldn't it uh, uh, j just any old plane. I don't. I don't care really. Uh, so long as it can get me from the nearest airport to where he is and back again. Um, and obviously, I don't have to pay for a hotel because he said I could stay in his apartment. Yeah. So, yeah, that's. I that's might. Cool, I but... might. Be, I might be going to Dubai in May, like mid-May. Really? Yeah. Oh, wow. Okay. I'm going to save my friend. My friend. Me and my friend are going. That's cool. No, uh, when I'm down by West Sussex. Yeah. Yeah, I'll, I'll link up with you, innit? Yeah, definitely. Like, anytime you're near. Yeah. That, I've loved mm. you. I think you're such a lovely guy. Yeah. And I, I think you have to be... Because it's... 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 Um, it's... Uh, it's to your character. It's to your character that you've built a positive community of loyal people supporting, and I've Definitely. done the same as well. And I think it's quite a big thing when you get to the point where you've built up this community of like-minded, positive people. And I personally, if I was you, I wouldn't give that away so freely because. Right. Just as as Bonnie probably said to you previously, you know, she's trying to keep people at arm's length because it reflects yeah. back on you. Um, if you're, you know, if you're in with this stuff, so just I would just say, George, just be careful because you're great as yourself. Like Thanks you don't lot, actually need lot. anybody. You don't need. To be yeah, I mean, that's the that's the exact point. Is with Ed and HS. I can post them yeah. without them being in my life. I don't need to be really close to them. That's a choice. That's a preference. And they know that. I can still yeah. post them without them being in my life. But I prefer to be friends with them because I've posted them for years. And I've met her twice. And I'm essentially going to meet HS at some point. So being friends with them makes my life a lot easier, put it that way. And, yeah. you know, I just, at the moment, it's strange because... If I post Ed content or Elsa content or even uh, Bella's content, it gets so many views. I don't even have to try that hard. But if I post yeah. HS content, it's like I'm struggling. 
I'm literally it's, struggling and, to get views. Because it's the same, because the term at HS now is similar to that Andrew Tate thing. If you ever was to post anything related to AT, it's never going to get off the ground. I get banned. I get banned yeah. for posting any article, anything that has Andrew Tate. I get banned. My video gets banned. So I can't actually go near Andrew Tate ever again because he'll yeah, risk all my accounts. It's now like going into the HS thing now because of the PR. That's why. And obviously he doesn't have a manager to like handle all the stuff because that's if because he... That, and that's because no agency, no professional, actual digital agency would take somebody on who is so dangerously, you know, one thing, and it's, you know, it could be all over the national papers. This is, we're talking big stuff. I, I I mean, it would make my life so much easier if HS was in the UK. I could catch a train and see him in a few hours. So catching yeah. planes halfway across the world makes it a million times harder. So if he has to cancel, in some, I might be relieved because I've never caught planes before. I wouldn't know what to do. So yeah, if he gonna, literally... I was going to say that to you as well. That's quite a big thing emotionally for you to go through. It will mm. definitely set you off as well. Because if you don't like doing things out of your structure, that you're going to be very anxious. It is very anxiety inducing yeah. when you do go to an airport anyway. And yeah. Yeah. If, if he definitely pays for the plane tickets, I'll definitely go and see him. No matter how stressful it is, I will actually do my best to go and see him. So, yeah. you know, that's a massive thing. If he spends that kind of money for me to go and see him, then I'll definitely sort it out. Yeah. Um, and I think to some extent he does have a level about caring about me. Like he, he almost sees me as a brother. Like he wants me to be similar to him which I, I understand that's what brothers do. The same with Ed, Ed gave me his coat and I'm wearing it now. <laughs> it's one of my favorite yeah. coats. But um, Ed was very similar. Like, he wanted to do stuff with me and just have a great time. And yeah, so that's really good. It's, it's funny though, like I got on so well with Ed's mum and me and HS's mum fell out. So... <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. With Ed's mum, she's always stuck up for me. She's always been lovely to me. And she's even said, if I was single, George, you never know. I was like, what? So <laughs> she was dropping game on me. And then with Emma, not Emma, HS's mum, she saw a few videos of HS she didn't approve of on my account. And she commented on it. And then I was like, oh, it's really nice to meet you. I'm following you on so-and-so. And she said, I removed you. I was like, uh, okay. So I blocked her and that was that. And then one of HS's friends like fell out of me because I blocked one of his friends and the friend took that the wrong way, even though I, I can essentially block who I want. But yeah, so I've had more issues on the HS side somewhat mm. than I have on the Ed side. So I've, that, that's, I don't blame HS for that. I just think it's they don't understand on the HS side, they don't understand my autism. They don't yeah. even, even if I try and tell them, they're like, blah, 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 blah. you're not listening to me, mate. I have autism, yeah. understand it, because you're literally trying to attack me for being someone normal. I'm not bloody normal. Whereas on the Ed side, they can, they understand a lot better and they like structure the way they treat me and their behavior around me to help me. So it's a lot easier. Yeah. Um, plus, Ed wants to see me this weekend. So let's say HS cancels. I can go and see Ed anyway. So mm. I'll be seeing one of the two for sure this weekend. It's going to be busy for real. Yeah, I just hope it's not a risk or detriment to you. Like, if you're saying already they're not understanding, you know, or making allowances for, you know, your... Yeah, I mean... Your, I, I, then that just is not a good vibe. Personally. Yeah, I think I think deep down, I do love HS and Ed as brothers. I've always cared about them deeply, and they mean a lot to me. And it hurts when I fall out with them, and they fall out of me. It really does hurt me deep. 
so when we make up and we're like brothers again that's really it does change me mentally and physically like for the better yeah. so you know that's really good and it the future's looking bright my account i wouldn't be where i am without those two because i've essentially found a gap in the market and dominated it and yeah everyone goes to my account for the updates about ed and hs mainly and that's what people love so mm. i keep doing that and just i'm going with the flow as it were because <laughs> today i got a record of like 1000 followers in like the space of an hour i was like okay that's not normal i've never seen that before is that normal for you like you get thousands um it has been in the past but recently obviously the algorithm switch off it is more difficult to gain followers now definitely um but that's really good so you're obviously riding something there like the algorithm yeah i think um i'm not what i'm getting that? less, less uh, that was when i was live with hs and he said follow george and then i was literally oh, spammed yeah, yeah, with yeah. follows and then i went off onto my other phone and checked and it said 909 followers and i was like oh, yeah. wow that's really good well done because the ratio of that to people following me is a bit crazy so essentially like almost he had like four people 4k people watching him so 1000 people of watching him followed me so that does as say a lot about what people think of me but i think i'm dealing with everything pretty well considering i do have autism and i used to be completely isolated and never talk to anyone yeah so, no, you're do that's really good like clearly. yeah thank you and, and i think i know obviously you have the autism thing i have dyslexia and oh, aspects, right. cool. aspects of other things as well but you know i actually think all right madison Oh. I've just been watching the live and I'm going to reevaluate my situation in it. Reevaluate the situation. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't don't you have bare free time because of because of your line of work? What do you mean? What well, I mean, like cuz you and George are good mates, aren't you? Well, I met George yesterday, I think. Yeah. What in real life? No. No, on on the live. Yeah, but I feel like you could look after George and add a bit of add a good dynamic to Dubai. I'm not gonna lie. I'm probably coming to Dubai in May, mid May. Why mid May? Because that's the only time me and my friend can go. I thought, aren't you free twenty four seven? Aren't you printing that online cash? Yeah, but I mean, I have dogs and things. Why? What are you saying? I'm saying come with George this weekend. Oh, I can't. I definitely can't this weekend. I'm selling my house, so I've got viewers. Oh, Jesus. Damn. Why are that, you that, um, moving or something? Yeah, I've got my house up for sale, so I've got to go look at other things as well. All right, fair enough. I literally just joined a few to see if he was up for a bit of fun. All right, feel like you too. Are you taking him out this weekend? Yeah, probably on Saturday. <laughs> Wait, what, what day is it today? Is it Friday? I've got to book it's your Thursday. flight. Thought, like, yeah, I was going to DM you about what what um, airport just, I needed just, booked just book from book, too. George, send me your passport and send me your like location. I'll just book it tonight. I'll get my mum to do it. Yeah, but put him okay. put him in like business so that the air hostesses can obviously look after him in terms of his potential anxiety sort of thing. All right, Madison cat passport are you mad i'm not taking my cats with me <laughs> why would i take my cat there if, if if two of them escape they become feral they no. become feral in another country i've lost them for good <laughs> jesus christ peeps they're, they're they're moving loose in the comments right now take your cat no yeah, but George, where are your cats gonna go they're not they're gonna stay in my flat where it's safe is someone going to feed them and water them? Like, yeah, no, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, cats be sorted. can live on their own, can't they? They can just do their own thing. Um, yeah, but I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to talk to my family because if I'm going to Dubai, I'm going to like speak to my family and say, this is happening. Da, 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 da. You, can you come in like once a day to my yard? I'll give you uh, the key and you can like feed them shit like that. 
and they'll go, mm-hmm. yeah, that's fine. So yeah, yeah. I'll speak to my mum. I'll phone her up and then tell her what's going on because she's the one that needs to know it the most. That's right, the only well, parent look, I've got. Mate, you just need to, like, as soon as you can, if you've got a spare phone, send me a picture of your passport and what airport's nearest to Why you. Why do you that. need a picture of my passport then? What's the, the passport. To, to, book, to book your flight, bruv. Oh, oh, you need that for the flight. Oh, shit, I didn't yeah, realise. Yeah. What about this COVID stuff? I don't need any tests done or anything like that, then. No, nah, Dubai's okay. not backwards like that. Dubai doesn't believe okay. in, in the flu. Brilliant, that's great. Um, yeah, and then if if you... Um, Probably Saturday, What time mate. are you planning to book it for? What time? You're free in it 24-7. Essentially, yeah. I was just thinking I'll what just time. I'll just book it middle because, of the day. I'll just book it middle yeah, of the day. Yeah, because day. Um, I, I have to obviously... I'm not going to bait you out. I'll just have to go to a hotel that's literally right next to the airport. Yeah. Stay the night before. And then, so when the, the day comes, I can literally just walk to the airport five minutes George, away and jobs are good. Then, isn't it? George, where's your nearest airport? What is your nearest airport? Norwich. That's well, not, not the place to Dubai, babe. You're going to have to go. They, to, like, they have connecting flights though, don't they? I swear yeah, they do. Well, You'll be best going to Stansted, Heathrow, Luton, potentially, but... Mate, fuck getting a connecting flight as long as... Yeah, it's so, just... George, it'll make... What, would I have to catch five connecting flights or something? <laughs> oh, mate, don't worry, I ain't going to stop you off in fucking Mumbai. Fuck that. <laughs> <laughs> no, I would have to, um, I'd have to, like, have a look, because I, if I ever go to London, I get lost all the time if I go to London. I get lost Well, we can map it out for you. Like, we can give you the... Like, your taxi will know, so you could get a taxi straight there. And then mm. we'll tell you exactly where that is. It'll probably be Heathrow that you'll have to fly from, most probably. Because it's come up half term as well. So flights are going to be crazy for, because everyone's going to go on holiday to Dubai over half term. I'll see, I'll see how many flights Wait, there are. Is your mate fit, Madison? Is your mate fit? Yeah, my mate's fit. All right, cool. How are they shutting the door that loud for? Jesus. All right, George, just send me a picture of your thing and I'll, I'll sort it out tonight then. Thanks. What day is it today? It's, it's, I thought it's Friday, so it's Thursday. No. So just, yeah, cool. Come yeah. on Saturday. If my mum's not gone, I'll just put you in a hotel and I'll stay in the hotel with you. Well, um, why can't I stay in the same house as your mum? Uh, no. Because there's not... <laughs> Cause, cause his I didn't. Dead. I didn't mean that. I didn't mean that to sound sus. I meant that to sound. Hi, Ruby. Wait, that's that's that's. Who's this fucking slut? Hello. She's she's laying as hell. We love you, Madison. <laughs> Hi. Love how you. are you? Madison, you're yeah. Hello. Hey. How are you? We're good. How are you? Yeah, really good. Thank you. Are you, two OF, are you two OS are you two OS fighting in your corner for you? <laughs> <laughs> They're not slasses. They're nice people. Are you, so are you trying awesome? to eat Ruby and your blonde mate? Are you trying to come to buy and get stuck in the telegram? I'm pretty yeah, cool. That's a horrible thing to say. She's wifing material, HS. She's wifing material. Oh, yeah, <laughs> <laughs> Jeez, she's got some spice, Ruby. Jeez. Is this the thing that you're on to, George? Uh, she, she wears the lip gloss. She knows. She knows my weaknesses. Yeah. <laughs> she knows how to get me easily, and she and she's she hasn't even known me for that long. She knows exactly how to handle me, wrapped around a little finger. It's really <laughs> jarring, but there you go. Have <laughs> <laughs> you been, have you been DMing? Not as such, no. She, she's a busy woman. Do you know what I mean? She's, she's a model woman. What do you do, Ruby? What do you do? What do you do? Um, <laughs> apart from modelling, no, I'm joking. I'm not. Model- <laughs> uh, Wait, you're students. not. I thought you were. We're students and accountants. Really? Mm. Yeah. Madison's like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah good account. You, you girls ain't accountants, bollocks. Okay. Okay, 
Bruni, your hair colour is so cool. Hey, it's sick, isn't it? Thanks. It's, it's really nice. personality trait is having red hair. I've got red nails. Yeah, it's really lovely. Thank you, thank you. So we Why all go to Christian the... Beach in the summer then? <laughs> Let's go to Dubai. Are you talking to me? Talking to everyone. What did she say? He's what did you say? Are we all going to Ocean Beach in the summer then? Is that where you go? Oh yeah, that's where were we. Were you live. there last year? That's where we live. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we were. I didn't. I don't think I saw you. I was there for like quite a few months. Do you know any of the boys that go out like stay out there the whole summer? Uh, you know no. Harry Aaron's. Nah, no, 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 no. Sam Brown. Who's that? No. Charlie Flo. <laughs> Who? Charlie Snow. <laughs> no, I don't know. Yeah, but yeah, I'll be there in the summer. George, George is coming with me as well. Yeah. Yeah. Well, um, essentially, there's there's enough room for me in that apartment they're in for for me to like stay there for a bit. So I'm talking about IB for bro. I'm saying, mate, me and me and the fucking a few men. If you stay, if you come back to Dubai just before. Summer, we'll get a jet from Dubai to Ibiza, and you can roll months. Yeah, I'll, I'll even pay for your flight, Ruby. Isn't it? I'll play for your flight. <laughs> <laughs> I'm meeting you. Come hell or high, I'm meeting you eventually. <laughs> Wait, I'm gonna make this link up happen, bro. <laughs> Mate, that'd be legendary. Can you imagine? She'd be like, "Oh my god, you're so old." I'd be like, "Yeah, don't mind the walking stick. That's just that's just a casual thing, isn't it?" Do you know what I mean? <laughs> Trust. Well, we're going to be there in June the eighth, and then for closing as well. So hopefully, we cross paths. June the eighth. Uh, yeah, it's my birthday. Yeah, we. I'll probably be there. Or my. Are you going? Are you going back to the yeah. UK after I be for you? We're going Marbella. We're going Marbella as well. Are you going Marbella bank holiday? No, oh, everyone else is going. Oh, no. Then music on, Amsterdam. Yeah, music on. Why is my fucking head? Why are you not going Marbella Bank Holiday? That's when it's going to be active. Who's going? Going? Yeah, we didn't really know that was a thing, quite uncultured apparently. But yeah, mate, it's active. We're going music on in Dam instead. So. Oh my god, damn this summer, George. I could tell you was dropping a bit of nervous game with Ruby. She's a different one for you, isn't she? She's got you like I'm you. Like you her. like her. Yeah, but she, she 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 knows I can't just go down the road and meet up with her. So it's it's like a long game with her, isn't it? So I've got to play it. I've got to play it cool, isn't it? I can't let my true intentions known. Otherwise, she'll just block my ass. You can't. You can't just. Let... <laughs> well, your true intentions. <laughs> Not true intentions. That sounded <laughs> sus. I meant as in, you know. Beat and delete. He's trying to beat and delete. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. I have good intentions, gentleman intentions, isn't it? Oh, I don't know about that, George. I don't know about that. You just, you just I'm not. It. I'm not sus in any way, HS. You've just got to ask all my exes if I'm sus, and they'll say, yeah, "No, he's lovely." You're a player, George. Uh, me player, never. Like, you are, yeah, mate, I've got the charm. Up. Like when you come to buy, you're gonna be, you're gonna be a player. I'm telling you. <laughs> are you trying to change me into Dr. Jekyll and Hyde? Is that what you're going to do to me? What? Dr. Jekyll and Hyde, oh. you'll turn me into this mad HS player, sort of, innit? Light skin. Yeah, light skin. Light skin? Yeah. Light, light skin player, that's what I'll be. I'll be <laughs> the, the lighter version of HS. Yeah, mate, that's what you're going to become. Anyway, listen, you girls, I'm off. Oh, no. In a bit, in a bit, bro. Ah, oh, guys, Madison, we love you. Yeah, hey. we love you. Oh, yeah. thank you so much. We literally watch your lives, yeah, when you've got just like pathetic little men on. And oh, we're, my God. We're just <laughs> yeah, watching it. Like, get them. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, we're just watching all these small dicks talking to you. Like, just, we love you. Don't oh, I rate that. Thank you yeah. so much. <laughs> Girl, so, I where, are you, yeah. where are you girls from? We don't really say, but we're from... Oh, okay, fine. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I take that, honestly. I wasn't personally, yeah. but yeah. yeah. But yeah. Yeah, well, it's nice to meet you. Yeah, um, you too. I'm, I'm going to have to bounce because I've got to go get my dogs, but it's nice to meet oh, you. Oh, you I'm too. Happy. Yeah, I followed you as well. And George, thank you for clearing that up as well. I appreciate that. Yeah, um, uh, it's my pleasure because I knew he didn't mean any of that. He was just, I think, a wind up. So I'm glad I sorted yeah. it out for you. 
No, Brilliant. thank you. I'll take that. It's my um, pleasure. Was... Well, let me know. We'll chat about the whole flight thing as well. So Yeah, definitely. Definitely. We'll That'd that. be great. But thank you so much. Girls, have a good night. And you too. Thank you. Thanks. Bye. 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 Now we've got you alone, George. Yeah. <laughs> That's what, that was your whole intention from the beginning, isn't it? Puss, yeah. can you get off the ring light, please, Puss? Puss. Off the ring light. <laughs> Sorry, my cat's getting in the way. Isn't it? Get off, Puss. Can no, stop piss? doing that. <laughs> what are you so drinking? So was the piss, George. The piss? The What's piss, that? Uh... <laughs> the piss. <laughs> Hold on. I'll try my best. What the fuck? Puss. Oh, oh, puss. He's rubbing himself on my 